Hello everybody, this is the Lights Above Us here, bringing you guys Torchlight 2 Part 2. I did make a video on, you know, how I'm going to change the quality of my videos, and it, it, I looked at the video and it did not lag as much as I expected it to. So that was actually pretty good. Now, it wasn't the HD quality that I'm actually seeing. This game is actually pretty nice, you know, pretty nice detail, but, you know, I feel bad because I'm, I'm, making, you, I'm making a Let's Play for you guys, and I'm not giving you guys the highest quality I could possibly make. And you guys can't see how beautiful this game actually is. But anyways, let's go ahead and get right into this. Wow, I just lagged a bit right there. I don't even really know why I don't have that much things open. But I was playing on my other profile, as you guys can see in the test video. So we're going to go ahead and go on to our profile. Normally, we wouldn't start out at the title screen. But, you know, I haven't played this game in a while. Well, I was just playing it. But I haven't done a Let's Play of this game in a while. Or, like, an episode of Let's Play of this game in a while. So we'll actually get past this stuff these are uh, other profiles this is my other profile ember mage uh this is my name my name's angel if you didn't know some of you already know like for real life or anything but you know th this, these are just friends this is my cousin actually but I, i'm not here to explain this stuff anyways go ahead play as light single player i'm actually gonna do this and oh one spent unspent set point one unspent set point all right Go ahead. The loading menus aren't really that long in this game. It just may seem a bit long for you due to the game, you know, stops respawning after a bit. But it's only, you guys already know, it's usually only the first lag screen. It's only the first load screen. Why did I say lag screen? Anyway, it's only, only the first load screen that actually takes a while. Then the next ones are like, you know, they load for like around two seconds or so. <sighs> Sorry, I'm just getting a drink. Some good juice. Anyway, so here is where we were last time. We were, uh, if you can't read that, reach the Asterian Enclave and speak to Grand Regent. You know what? I'm going to see if I can do you guys a favor and go ahead, video. See if I can turn up particle detail high, shadow detail low. See if I can turn up the actual... Don't know if I can turn up... Hmm... Don't know if I could turn up the letter size. Anyways, uh, I, I, I really wanted to turn that up for you guys. I don't know why I went like, ah, 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 but, you know. So, so here we are. Let's go ahead and beat up some more beasts and stuff like that. Get some gold. Alright. So we're going around 2 minutes 41 seconds. That's where we're at right now. And I'm gonna go for around 10 minutes each episode until my internet gets better because you know uh, my, I, We need to get better internet in order for me to upload around 20 minutes videos 20 minute long videos like I used to do when I went back when I used to do videos in this channel I deleted them all but if you wanted to see them sorry, but I did delete them all And that's why you know I have so many subs from when I used to do videos and I have a couple new subscribers as well but other than that my videos were like 20 minutes long and they would take me like hours upon hours to upload which is why I'm doing them in like 10 minutes parts but I'm gonna try to record as much episodes as I actually can ooh level 3 uh, I'm gonna upload as much episodes as I actually can pretty much while you know in one day well not upload up uh, record in many years like one day and I'll probably record around 2 episodes a day and eventually if I'm in a good mood which I, I'm always almost every day in a good mood but if I'm in like a really 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 super super tastic Fantastic, jizz-tastic mood then I will upload around like um, just like spam you guys with videos if that isn't too much guys so as I said earlier I'll try to record as much as I can today and I'll try to get as much done as each episode as I can now we did level up so we can go ahead and upgrade the skills as I said earlier I'm not gonna try to spend too much because if I do spend too much then eventually I won't be able to uh, get this one back so we'll spend it once we get to the town because I, I, I'm not gonna go as I mentioned in the previous episode I think I did that we are gonna be working on the shadow skill tree and we're actually gonna have to be able to you know get our skill point back but if we use more than three then this one we won't be able to get this one back so so I'm not gonna use my skill points but I can use my stat points uh, well, like I said earlier or last episode we're actually going to try to work on evening this out before we start to work on individual you know individual stats on, alone so so here we are getting things uh are these what are it's plus five mana what is this dude it's, it's just all right uh these are actually 40 damage per second go ahead and replace that 
Wait, I think one of these is better than the other. This is 22, and this one's 32. Alright, so let's put the 32 in here. That way we do more damage. Uh, This one's actually a pocket pistol. Actually, if we need to do... I usually have... Oh yeah, I already told you guys this second class thing, but it... I usually do ranged. If you've seen in my test, my lag test video, I do ranged in my second class. And then like close ranged in my first, so... You know, if I ever need, if there's like an enemy or like across, like across the screen or something, I just like press W. All right, I got a pistol and I'm ready. But I think these ones are actually ranged. Not really sure, but I could try. You know, to test it out. Oh, well, I couldn't test it out really there. I just like pretty much ran up to the guy, but I test it out from here. Oh, actually, it goes a pretty fair distance. Oh god, a lot of gold. <coughs> After we get farther into the series, series, we can actually pretty much set a setting where it will hide some of the items. So, like, if we have an item that, you know, is pretty much the best item in the game or the best item that we, you know, we are good with, then it could actually, we could actually set a setting so that it doesn't show, you know, if we have, like, an ultimate, like, hunter, hunt, huntsman bow or whatever, like, over here talking to you, I meant, like, you know, a bow, like, huntsman accidentally came up, but, you know, a bow, and we have, like, an awesome bow. Or we have a lot of gold or anything, you know, we can actually change the setting so that it doesn't show gold as a loot drop. And automatically, you know, you can actually choose to pick it up or not. But I don't think I'll actually change the gold setting off. Oh, I, I might actually take some settings off, such as, you know, if I get, like, if I don't really like, you know, I'm not really cool with... If I already have, like, a lot, a lot, a lot of, like, tokens or, like, not tokens, like, belts or, like, you know, pants or I have, like, pants that are good right now, I'll probably change the settings so that I don't get any. Like, right now, I don't have that many items, so I'm always looking for new items, but, you know, if I get a nice hood, I might eventually, like, make a setting so that I can't, I can't find, like, say, say this is, like, the best, like, cowl in the game, or, like, shoulder I said like a shoulder armor in the game then you know I, I wouldn't want to trade it so I would be like you know what let me take the setting off so that I don't find any shoulder armors so then yeah so I, I you know I can keep the shoulder armor let's go ahead and walk here another reason I like this game is that it's easily controlled it's you know friendly user friendly interface everything else it's not really confusing and it actually tells you what everything is and I know I should have explained everything in the first episode but there was so much to explain about this awesome game that I couldn't even, you know, explain all of it in around one episode. Even though that episode is actually pretty short. Now here we are to the Enclave where we can actually get our skill points back and then fully start our quest. Because I don't think uh, we've actually started our quest yet. Because, you know, I'm not over here just rushing through this. Now usually I wouldn't rush through this as I am right now. But I wanted to get to the Enclave to get our quest. So yeah, after this point, I won't be rushing that much. I'd more be, you know... I don't know, as you can say, I would, I would play the game normally. Like right now, this is how I'm. This is not how I normally play the game. I wouldn't like commentate over like actual stuff. Like when, once we get into the actual adventure, I will talk only about Torchlight, nothing else, no updates unless it's really important. Just, just only Torchlight, Torchlight only. And right now, I'm actually since we're rushing to the Enclave, I'm actually talking about like channel updates and not. So from now on. Now that we've actually started the quest, now that we're actually in the Enclave, no more channel updates unless they're really important. I'll do those in another video. No more, like, talking about other Let's Plays I'm going to start. Alright, really serious talk. We're going to 8 minutes, and we're waiting for 9. Hello everybody, welcome to the second episode. I know this is the same video, but we're actually really literally starting the series off now now no more intro no more nothing this guy is skill repeat now uh, this is what i was talking about you can only reclaim the last three skill points you have invested so i didn't want to waste that many skill points we go ahead and remove this and we get a free skill point there you guys go and go ahead go to skills we can go ahead spend this one on frenzy mastery which is your feral nature grows more powerful and harder to suppress increasing the duration of your frenzy states acquired from filling the charge bar which is right around here the more we hit somebody you know it will it will fill up and then eventually we get crits and stuff like that so uh the frenzy duration for 6.5 seconds i wouldn't i wouldn't normally read all of this but yeah let's go ahead for shadow burst there we go I really like Shadow Burst. I think it's a really good 
no attack. I don't. I don't. I use it a lot in my other profile. I just. I'm not getting into that stage where I like to use it a lot yet. <laughs> this is actually something I'm gonna share. A uh, shared stash. This is getting to ten minutes, so I'll really quickly explain this. This is shared stash. This is all my stuff from my other profiles. You know, my friends' profiles. You know, my all my other profiles. Basically, any profile in the game, making share stuff. I can get all stuff now. I won't be taking from this because I, I count it as cheating. So we have our own stash as well. But yeah. Really hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, guys.